Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am currently outside. We are heading over to a cafe this morning. Not gonna lie though, I'm kind of hungover right now, so I feel like I really need to eat something. I saw this cafe that had like really good desserts, so hopefully we can grab one and feel better. But right now, kind of in this alleyway, trying to figure out where to go. So I'll catch up with you guys when we get to the cafe. Starting my morning with a very simple breakfast. We have a banana pie here, which has ice cream and I believe cinnamon powder. And then, of course, a coffee. I got a hot vanilla latte because it's pretty cold outside, but low key, I'm pretty hungover right now. So, hopefully, this will give me a little bit of a pick me up. We're gonna enjoy this, then walk around. I might get a shinsa later, not sure yet, but I'll catch up with you guys once I finish breakfast. right now but this banana pie is literally saving my life it is so good especially if you get like some of the pie with the ice cream it just tastes so amazing definitely like the perfect hangover cure but I'm gonna keep eating now and then like I said we'll play really explore the area before we head over to Shinsa got done with my coffee originally I planned to go to Shinsa because I wanted to do some shopping not sure if you guys are aware but all the stores are on sale right now but then I realized today's Monday and I get paid Friday so I was like you know what don't don't blow your budget this month, just wait till the end of the week and then we'll go shopping instead. So I think right now I'm gonna go home, I wanna take milk out and do some things at home. So I'll catch up with you guys later. I'm meeting a few friends this week because I am on vacation. So hopefully I can add that to the vlog, but I'll see you guys when I see you next. So today we've come to Shinsa. I'm meeting my friend Alex. We're gonna get brunch together, do some shopping, and of course go check out a cafe. Right now we're in Midtown. I'm sure I've vlogged here before, like in the past. If I have, I'll insert it above. If not, I'll show you guys around because this place is really cool. It's actually at night a bar, and let me just say the nighttime vibes are like so it. Um, I love coming here at night, but kind of pricey. But let me just show you guys around before we get out food because we got some pancakes, and oh, I'm so excited. Much time to waste and not enough to do what you got to lose. Got nothing left to prove when well, my love hit me up when I'm stuck in my head and my just out of luck throw me back to my bed. The our food has arrived. Like I said, we both came for the pancakes. So Alex got these strawberry or berry or fruit pancakes. Looks really good. And then I went for a savory style. I went for the chicken and pancakes. Oh my god, check out the chicken. It looks so delicious. And the fried bacon on top of course maple syrup but we're just gonna take some photos now and then we're gonna eat our meal there's so many things that i wish i could say but my voice just goes away I'm gonna give the chicken pancakes a try as you saw i put maple syrup on it so hopefully it's like not too sweet but let's give it a go really good actually um i know in america it's like a big thing to eat like maple syrup and chicken and waffles usually but um in australia i wouldn't say it's a thing actually my dad came to visit and i took him to this american style restaurant that had that and he was so like shook up he was like what is this why is it chicken and waffles in my case chicken and pancakes but let me just say i think it's a good combo you guys did well on that We have arrived at the coffee shop. I didn't film my shopping spree because 
I was just lazy, I'm gonna be honest with you guys, but I did shop a lot, so I will give you a mini haul either here or when I get home. But right now we're on this rooftop of a cafe we came to, I'll show you guys this cafe too. But we're trying to get like the Ugg shot. If you guys don't know the Ugg shot, essentially it's where you have your Uggs and a coffee in your hand and it just looks real cute. And we're trying girls and guys if you're watching, but it's just not happening. Alex just got a latte, I got a flat white, but we're on the rooftop now getting some pics and then we're gonna drink our coffee and just chill after a day of shopping. So this is her Ugg shot. This is what I'm working with. I'm like, <laughs> we are trying. I'm just saying, we are trying. And of course our coffee's here, which I showed you already, but yeah. <laughs> I want to give you guys a quick OTD just because I feel like my outfit today was pretty on point. So firstly, I'm wearing this hat, which is from A Secret. Um, I'll tell you guys eventually, so no price or anything. Um, jacket though, I got yesterday. It is this really nice trench coat. It is from Vim Prime, which is a secondhand store in Korea. It's only 20000 Can you believe that? Like, it's so nice. And then, of course, my shirt is just like a white t-shirt. Stole from my husband. And then... My jeans are from Zara. They're on sale for like 30000 I believe. And then, of course, I'm wearing my Uggs, if you guys can see those. They were the most priced I had my own. Um, they were like 2001 or $200, which I don't know why it's so expensive in Korea. Are they that price to the rest of the world? I don't know. And then, of course, jewelry here. Anna Luisa, which was gifted, obsessed. But yeah, that is my OTD day. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. I don't know. It's just kind of order. We got six things. We got two burgers, some french fries, some fried squid, and of course two drinks. Let me show you guys real quick. Firstly, here's one of the burgers. Um, the other burger, the fries, the fried squid, and just a Sprite and orange juice. But I'm gonna open up the burgers so you guys can have a proper look at them. So prestigiously, I think the rap game be needing me. Didn't know my dream would be so attainable. Still out of reach is teasily Spitting the ether It's hard for me to be that nigga When I've been that nigga Ever since the itty bitty black boy The burger Which as you guys are aware I got the mac and cheese burger It is very messy It looks like super creamy honestly Like just looks like mac and cheese And a lot of mayo So not really sure how it's going to taste But let's give it a go Okay, I pretty much just got a big bite of mac and cheese, and I'll say the mac and cheese is pretty good, but if you guys are looking for a good mac and cheese burger in Korea, I definitely recommend Builder's or Brooklyn Burger. Their burgers, mac and cheese burgers, are amazing, but this one's not bad. Let me get some meat though, because I didn't try the meat part. Okay, the meat or the patty, it tastes like um, Burger King actually, or Hungry Jack's. Um, it's not bad, but I prefer, again, McDonald's, but overall, the burger, despite how it looks and how messy it is, it's pretty decent for a cheap um, fast food. We have finished with lunch now. Honestly, I would give it maybe like a 6 out of 10. It wasn't my favorite, as you guys are aware. McDonald's is definitely the one that holds my heart, but the burgers, they were like so-so. Um, the fries put a let down, but the squid triangle things, they were pretty good, so I'll come back for those. But now that we're done with lunch, I'm gonna go do some shopping, like I said, watch a movie. So we're back at home now. I kind of didn't really film much after No Brand Burger. Like I said, all we did was go shopping and watch a movie, but home now, I'm gonna edit this vlog, and then tomorrow I go back to work, so winter vacation is over. Really sad about that. If you guys haven't already though, please like and subscribe to my channel, and I'll see you on the next one. Bye! Ammo going blammo out the chamber, rat a tatter, got